great, beautiful, blissful rising to all of my king, queen, gods, and goddesses. It is your boy, Terrible Wanstar. I got to break it down to y'all. Sun, moon, rising, north, northern, Venus, or wherever is that in your chart. Hey, salutations. Look, the title of this one is Don't Hold Yourself Back for This New Beginning, okay? Don't hold yourself back from this new beginning. So, let's go ahead and get into it. I'm not going to be with you too long, but you know I got to bring some type of information. So, Spirit, Guys, Angel, Universe, we thank you right now for everybody coming to the channel. Lead us, guide us, give us the blueprint and the understanding towards our highest good and highest expectations. Now, anybody wish any ill will mentally, physically, spiritually, financially, emotionally, Emotionally, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna send that energy to the universe in abundance of love and never to the sender, okay? I say, I say, amen. Now, Virgo, this new starting point that you may be going into, Virgo, it is dealing with you, dealing with toxic cycles within yourself, dealing with toxic cycles, dealing with people, about people who may be giving you false information, or somebody may be going in the wrong direction where instead of you feel like you are sending, you are more like descending in a relationship relationship or whatever type of energy that you may be in, okay? Now, I feel like right now, Virgo, for you, uh, you may be feeling kind of down and out or feeling tied to somebody who like to make a lot of broken promises or like, uh, somebody who don't value you in harmony the way that you value them, okay? Now, Virgo, I am also sensing that right now it may be some delays in the type of action that you may be going with this person because either you or somebody else may feel like, absorbed, okay? Now, the challenge Challenges, though, for you, we'll break it down a little bit more when we get into this reading. This is just a pre-shuffle. So I feel like right now, Virgo, you are going through the learning experiences when it comes to your emotions. Uh, you are going through the learning ex experiences as well into how to be more wise when it comes to people that you may be dealing with that you had to be cautious of or putting them on a pedestal. Okay, Virgo? Now, I feel like you may rushed into this back in your past or rushed into some type of situation with somebody, but now since you are taking the time to be more structured, you are realizing the things that is controlling you or controlling this ship that you may be on in order to push forward, okay? Now, Virgo, you may be walking away or following your intuitions about the delays and warnings about the things you need to overcome, dealing with this individual as well as dealing with yourself. Now, Virgo, I feel like it was some un unexpected event or some type of tower moment that fell in that brought some type of disaster when it comes to somebody maybe trying to win at all costs. This can be you or this can be the other energy around you, Virgo. But I am sensing that what you do not see that the energy that a person wants did not pour in you. They are ready to probably pour into you, Virgo. And now the only thing about it is you may be holding yourself back off of some of the things that they have done to the past to you and you may not be willing to forgive them, okay? Now, let's go ahead and get into meditation and then when we get into meditation we're gonna jump directly into this again shout out to everybody who's been watching the channel so far shout out to my new ones now if you my a1 day ones y'all know what to do hit that like button for us so we can make the channel grow so other people can get the information that we need got it through by spirit okay so what we're gonna work on today is fluidity okay it helps you with inner nourishment uh refreshment and emotional ease release uh this releases muscular contraction supports the joints and eases inflammation now cultivates emotional fluidity and calmness, okay? Gentle ways of ease flow through my mind and body. That's what we're going to work on when we get into meditation. Gentle ways of ease flow through my mind and body, okay? Now, place the right palm over the back of the left hand, both hands facing downward. Keep all of the fingers stacked while extending the thumbs to the side, okay? Holding hands with fingers extended outward away from the abdomen. So, let's go ahead and get in meditation. Breathe in. Positive energy. Positive light. Full abundance to your highest good and understanding. Now hold it. And release out all the negativity, all the stress, all the worries, all the doubts, all the concerns. Anything that's stopping you or hindering you, we're letting it go, okay? Breathe in. Positive energy. Positive light. Full abundance to your highest good and understanding. Now hold it. And release out all the negativity, all the stress, all the worries, all the doubts, anything that is holding you back, hindering you, setting you apart from being positive. We're letting it go one more time. Gentle waves of ease flow through my mind and body. Gentle waves of ease flow through my mind and body. Hold it. And release out, Virgo. Gentle waves of ease flow through my mind and body. Gentle waves of ease flow through my mind and body. Ashe, Ashe, 
And, uh, man, let's go ahead and see what we got for the Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, and Venus when it comes to what may be holding you back from this new opportunity. Spirit guys in the universe, what is the current energy for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, and Venus? What is the current energy for Virgo, Asha, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, and Venus? Now, Virgo, I feel like right now you may be going back to getting your power or air. Uh, it may be an Aries that's trying to be in power now. Take it as it resonates, okay? Now, here we go. Uh, you got the Emperor card basically being upright for you, Virgo. So you're getting back more into your authority. You are getting back into your power about anybody who's trying to make any excuses and not putting in the work, Virgo. I feel like right now what you may be going through, you may be going through with this Emperor mode. You are starting to accept things to be how they are because now you are starting to walk away from anything that is not making you happy, anything that's making you disappointed. Disappoint, disappointed, you are cutting through the BS and you're about to put some type of action. Now, it could be a controlling type of energy or something that is not suitable for you that you may be ready to move forward from or ready to move away from, okay? Now, Virgo, I feel like right now by you been moving so fast into your life and moving fast about the things that you want done, probably about a new job aspect, finances, or uh, when it comes to you actually thinking and being more logically, you're starting to understand about accepting yourself for the way that it is for this new starting point to take place. Now, I feel like you have been very, very dedicated. You have been doing in a lot of work to making yourself a better individual. However, you are still looking about if you pouring all this energy into a person or if you are pouring all of this energy into other things, will it come out to be fruition for you or will things come out to reap the rewards? I feel like right now, Virgo, you may be feeling like you are um, down and out or you may be feeling like you all alone left out in the cold because right now you are hanging on to something that you know that has stressed you out so far that you became numb to, okay? Now, also sensing some type of concern, doubts, or stress that you may be going through, maybe keeping you in a, keeping you at a distance with this person while you are gaining clarity to get everything understood back into your life. Now, I feel like, Virgo, you are a very generous person, but however, the person you may be generous with, you may be deep down feeling like this is not matching out with you on the love aspect because of a person is not giving you what you desire or a person is not reciprocating what you want. Yes, you've been very, very generous, generous. Like you've been humble with it. You've been very uh, passive uh, with your emotions dealing with people, but not because you've been avoiding and releasing. But now you finally get the logical understanding when it comes to choose yourself over emotions. You are starting to be victorious or you are starting to get the recognition that you deserve because you are not expressing yourself to a person like you want did before. Now, what I can say right now, uh, this control that or authority that you are getting back is dealing with past cycles that you had to be patient on or you had to get the spiritual lesson to be understood. Now, yes, you have walked away from a lot of situations and you have followed your intuition, but uh, right now, by you feeling rejected, sad, or lonely, dealing with this person giving you the unhappiness that's been going in for a while now that's been very slow, I feel like you are starting to harness your energy and, and um, not be frustrated with people that you know that you got to cut off. I feel like you put things at an all-time stop or halt because because the direction that you wanted to go, you had to overcome over the fears within the emotional self of you applying, not doing enough with all these burdens that a person may have been putting on you. Virgo, the demands that they had dealing with this uh, compassionate relationship, you started to realize now you may have made a poor decision or may be confused about the direction that you're trying to take to move forward. Okay, Virgo. Now, let's see what else that we got. Spirit guys in the universe, what else do we have for Virgo? Someone rising North Northern Venus. Now, Virgo, I feel like right now, what is going on for you, Virgo? I feel like right now, you being very empathic. Uh, and not only that, I feel like you are being more informative on the things that you need to do into your life, okay, Virgo? I also feel like right now as well that while you are turning around, um, you are starting to find more into yourself. So some of you may be doing a lot of meditation. Now, not only meditating, Virgo, I feel like you've been overcoming over your fears dealing with yourself as well, um, Virgo. Also, I feel like the way how you're not expressing yourself to this person is creating uh, this person to go through some type of lack of doubt uh, or maybe adversity dealing with the relationship. They know you very inspiring and they know um, 
that you very uh dedicated to be with them. However, they know whatever secrets or whatever uh hindering y'all is creating some type of uh toxic trait or some type of toxic attachment when it comes to y'all going down this road and that's what keep making y'all going down the wrong way when y'all be trying to change now virgo i feel right now this toxicity that may be going on may have blocked you from your intuition where you feeling confused about somebody who probably want to overindulge into themselves more than you virgo okay now i feel like you being uh instead of the lack of doubt that you may have i feel like right now you are starting to overcome the fears that you may be going through dealing with toxic people people and toxic traits with yourself and dealing with toxic traits with, that, uh, with people that you normally rush and try to help them that is not reciprocated. Virgo, I feel like right now the, the move that you are trying to make, you are trying to get yourself out of some type of sadness to get yourself out of some type of control dealing with uptight, bitter people. Now, I know they suppressing energy right now, but this tower moment that came into play made them realize now they may be feeling like at rock bottom because uh, you since you have pulled back, you have started to lift the burdens out of you but you poured it all on the dim and now it's moving in a slow motion for them so virgo even though you empathic to know about somebody deceptive ways or some somebody disloyalty i feel like now you are starting to balance your emotions with yourself and this is where the rewards are coming in for you to lift yourself higher up okay let's see what else let's see what's going on spiritually spirit guys and the universe what do we have for virgo someone rising north node of genius now, Virgo, I feel like right now you may be battling this new starting point because you may be feeling frustrated or not inspired to walk away from somebody. I feel like with the four swords basically being in reverse, you're not taking the time or the voice that you need to get yourself in order. And right now you need to do the things that is for your highest good to tackle over any demons within yourself or any deities that is stopping you from your change, from stopping you to be wise. Now, not only that, Virgo, you are starting to identify the problems within yourself to find out the best suitable interest towards you that you need when it comes to people that's giving you all these masks and even dealing with yourself, giving yourself masks around people that you know that is that you need to heal from. However, you are trying to progress and see things more clearly, but you're not being balanced until you identify yourself and turn around and go down this road of seeing people how they are to regain your power back okay virgo now that is beautiful on a spiritual level let's see what else do we got for virgo something rest. Now, Virgo, I feel like right now you got your, you getting your strength back and, and whatever been attacking you, you have not let it been uh, phasing you. It may be somebody maybe trying to gaslight you. You learn how to surrender your emotions and just release out the BS. Now, not only that, I feel like you starting to see through people and this is why spiritually you are not being invulnerable. You're not being vulnerable spiritually, but you keeping yourself guarded when it comes to anybody else around you. This healing aspect that you are going through, Virgo, you are releasing the control tactics and you are starting to release somebody mass and that's how you start to progress better now you know a person is unbalanced and going through a lot of emotional uh strife right now because they may be going through the dark night of the soul but however you're not hanging on from the limitation of fears of pushing forward you gain your authority back into love and you will start to accept that the contract that you may went through this person it has had to be yes you are attracted to this person but again it's that mars type of energy it's that love and war now i feel like with the contract you start to understand the divine intervention for a reunion but i feel like this person didn't want to go through the detours and now they because they got to pour energy into you and show yourself gratitude virgo but i feel like their ego is in the way and they have not learned the lessons that they need to learn okay now with that basically being said let's pull out a little bit more let's see how they feel about you virgo now i feel like right now i don't react when people mention you i feel like right now they're trying to suppress their emotions right now because the way how they feel about you they stay awake thinking about you all the time virgo as you gain your strength now they starting to understand now they can't stop thinking about you virgo again you pulled your energy back with this individual and for this new starting point they wish they had treated you better and now i see that's where a lot of burdens done came in and now they starting to understand you and i you and i weren't wasn't too old so i feel like this is the time for you or the divine time that they remember every detail of the day that they done something wrong or the lessons they didn't understand but now they grateful for the spiritual 
spiritual lessons because they can't stop thinking about you. But Virgo, they wish they treat you more better because they're not available right now. Maybe because they are uh, doing some work or maybe Virgo, they are busy doing everything else, but they want you very bad and they hope that you can forgive them one day. Uh, they want to be more than friends with you, Virgo, but they also replay the conversations over and over. So I feel like whatever y'all may have went through into your, uh, into your life, Virgo, I feel like right now that things are getting better. I feel like they starting to understand you and they starting to understand that in order for this new effort to happen for you and for them, you they're going to have to put in the work. And I feel like you are grateful for the support of the Divine Masters to help you get through these lessons. And this is why you can't let yourself mentally go backwards right now, Virgo, because you got all abundance and beauty in front of you right now, okay? So, I am grateful for all the support of Divine Masters and Transcendent Teachers who helped me on my spiritual journey. Ashe, Ashe, Amen. Today, I offer myself the unconditional love I respect and deserve. Ashe, Ashe, Amen. I am grateful to my body for supporting me through life. I am grateful for my body for supporting me through life. Ashe, Ashe, Amen. And I am fully supported by the universe. I am fully supported by the universe. Now, Virgo, if you want to read, and that is your personal reading, I just want to say, if you wanted to, text me, get at me, we can make it happen. I just want to say, okay, look, I'm no longer doing short mini readings right now unless I do them live. So uh, the 2222 is off. It's only half hour and an hour sessions. And with those, they are limited questions during that time frame. So if you ever want a reading, them are the readings. And that's why it, it is the way that it is. So I just want to say peace, love, and light. Light, love, and peace. I love you. God love you. Universe love you. Make sure you love who? Yourself. That's the most important thing on the channel. Till I see y'all beautiful souls. Till the next time. I shake. I shake. I'm in, baby. Yep. Yeah.